and we want to be not only uh, in crops that we have now embarked on like corn and soya mm -hmm. and wheat and cauliflower but we want to do hydrophonics which is very important for us mm -hmm. and we want to build a large park and a number of countries mm -hmm. are interested to look at Guyana's um, plan how we'll move it and I think that will be a boost for our agriculture sector. Exactly. Well we're looking at a number of crops but exotic crops things like grapes, black, um, blueberry, strawberries and, and those things and a lot of those things like um, um, lettuce and, and so doing and this. These are high value crops. Mm -hmm. Guyana never planned these before but through hydrophonics we can get it and you know when we had the Agri Investment Forum we had uh, a company from Tobago that, do, that, that normally does greenhouses. Mm -hmm. They are coming to, into Guyana to build a 15,000, 17,000 feet greenhouse to also do strawberries, grapes, and those crops. Well, we, we have many locations, but I am just now um, I'm, I'm, um, we're, we're looking at the best location possible, mm -hmm. right? But you know, hydrophonics, you have to concentrate most of the activity in one of the area because of the cost mm -hmm. associated. So I'm looking at the most feasible um, um, location.